And one morning again, we're standing on the corner of the film school and the main avenue, and the Russian tanks were coming back and forth and firing everywhere. We looked at each other, and, and he said, uh, let's go. And we knew exactly what it meant. You know, we went up to the a camera department of film school, got an Aeroflex, loaded up, you know, with battery and a shopping bag, and, uh, and we started walking uh, the streets. They all think that it was shot by Laszlo and Bill Murphy. They were about 25 uh, cameramen working on this. The men who took these films, like the freedom fighters they photographed, risked their lives to compile this record. When we were shooting the, the, the movie, we didn't realize that we could have been shot right, right there on the street because they killed people right and left just because they were doing stills. Camera was considered a weapon by the Russians, you know, because they shot you on a, on a, on a spot. In, in those instances, they could have been really catch us and uh, who knows what to do with us, you know. But, but at that time, we were a little bit more courageous than than we should have been, probably. But we were lucky, nobody caught us. There was, a, uh, there was one shot, a medic is running into, into the firing line, and there was a wounded person, you know. And just as he almost got behind a tank, the medic got shot. He was killed right there, but he saved the wounded person. I filmed, actually, the area as well well, we saw some freedom fighters dead on the street from that event. And there was this Hungarian flag with a hole in it. The hole was because we, the people, you know, cut out the heaven and cycle, which was the symbol of, of communism. That, that, that flag was in a way, you know, that I could shoot through the hole and see the freedom fighters face through that, which became a symbol, basically, 